Hello everyone, this is Trafalgar Valentine. How's it going today? Today I'll be doing another car drawing. Today's going to be a 49 Mercury. Okay, so to start off with, I've done like a rough block shape. I don't know if you can see it in pencil. Um, but this is just to give me a good idea of where I want the um, perspectives to go and stuff. So it's good to do like a block shape just to get you where you want things to go, blah, blah, blah. Okay, to start off with, I'm going to do the headlight. Do a round circle there, and the other one, this side, there. Sorry, I was just hesitating just to make sure I got it right. Then we're going to do a rim around the headlight. So quite thick on this side, so you'll see more of it. And because it's dented outwards, you'll see less of it on the to the side. I'm using a 0.3 ultra fine pen here. Nothing too fancy. But you can do this in pencil first off just to get your confidence up and things. I like doing this in pen. I want these smaller lights here. Okay, and then the badge goes roughly in the center. Then the grill, just going to do a curve there, one on this side. And I'm just going to join this up with the ruler. Across there. Now this line is uh, interrupted by the bumper, so I'm going to do the bumper first. Uh, before I do the rest of the grill. It's quite a chunky one. Now let's go come around here in a curved shape. I made a little mistake there, just remember my hand slipped off the page there, it's an uneven surface, but I'll fix that in a second. Then we've got these two bits that stick up here. And then bring the bumper back around. So, join these up. There's a center section of the grill coming down. Then we'll curl this grill round. Just like so. Okay, now for the main detail. It's, it's like a curved shape. And it's got these vents in it at an angle. Just like so. And then we'll do that across the entire grill. Try to keep it equal throughout. Just like so. And the same on the other side. that, maybe one more there, and the same on this side, some of these, a lot of these Mercury's have different grills but this is one from the photo reference I have, I've got a second line just going round, okay, so now for the front headlight, this goes right across the body, there's this chrome strip that goes right the length of the car, which would be good for lots of reference to where things will go. So I'm just going to do that. And I'm going to bring a second line up just above it. And I'm just going to stop roughly about there. Here is where above where the door handle will go for the door and then from here rises up a little bit and then comes to just at the end of this headlight. So I want to join those up by just pivoting my hand across. 
like so. Okay. Now the middle bit of the, uh, the hood is stuck up a little bit and the lights kind of indent but uh, what I'll do is I'll start on the other, other side of where the windscreen will go so maybe let's just draw the windscreen in just so we've got an idea of where I want other places to go we'll curl this round just like so and this has a chrome strip around it like so and now that we have that shape in we can join up the hood or come down there and this side join up then for the other side just do a bit of a fainter line just going down there do maybe one line going across there Okie dokie. Now for the front archway, we'll join that up to that chrome strip we did before. Come back down around about here. I'll bring this across. And just after where the door handles come along, rise up for the rear arch. This is a little bit lower than the front one up to about there back down then on the tail we've got the rear bumper sticking out and this chrome strip just a little short so I'm a little section just there then this curls around meet the windscreen then we'll do the passenger side window yep it's only a three door well I don't know if it's two door but it's, it's only got two doors on the front anyway and then the door comes over these and curls up here and just come straight down for well, a slight angle just round there and for this side so curls here just remember the shape of the car this bit stuck out a bit it comes back down I'll join us up inside of the archway okay Get this roof finished. So just gonna curl this around like so. Now we need the tires. So just pivoted my hand around like so. Then it's got kind of a white wall, so it's got kind of a thin layer of black around it. And then the centre hub, another circle. And then another one. And it's got this cylinder shape in the centre. like so then for the rear tire we'll keep this the same as that we'll bring it up you can't see all of it it is hidden a little bit behind and this angle for the front tire so keep that the same curl that round 
again just the same pattern as the front one so we've got a thin, a thin black which will be around there for the center hub okay so let's do a few more details around this passenger side around here there's a this picture has a line actually in the center of the windscreen so okay I think I'm ready to start moving into shading now the basic lines all done so what I'll do is I'll show you some shading patterns and blocks I'll do and I'll probably move into time lapse so for the chrome bumper for instance because this is a smooth metallic object it's going to reflect thick black lines but um, also reflect a lot of the environment around it so you could maybe do some trees or something inside of here and this lower section will reflect the ground so it'll be a bit darker and the top section will reflect the sky from, so that bit will be blue if you're doing it in colour I'm sure keep this pattern going across So, for the headlights, I'm just going to do a thick line on this side, do a line going across, and I'm just flicking that up, a few dashes here, nothing, no, it's not, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, okay. Then I'll do all the grill and just leave a little edge. Just like that. I'll do that in time lapse in a moment. I'll fill this up. Okay, now I'll probably do the lower section in uh, with thick black blocks at the bottom just to emphasize the shadow as well as the wheels. So I'm just showing where the blocks will be. And maybe one this side. Probably some shadow just here where it's a bit dark around the hood. I just noticed this line isn't joined up correctly to the windscreen, so I'm just going to smooth that out. All the shading now. <clears throat> <Cut. clears throat> okay, so I've finished up all the shading now. As you can see, I've just took out the negative light just so you can see it for what it actually is. But uh, yeah, filled it in with a thick uh, black marker pen just for the more chunky areas. Now I'm just smoothing out some of those lines just with a fine liner again. But yeah, it's turned out pretty nicely. Just got like Especially around some of the more delicate areas that are on the light, on the chrome bits here. Got small black shapes around the wheels. Just like so. Just emphasizing some more of the areas and shapes. Like that. And we'll make this bit a bit darker. Let me join this up. Uh, 
There we are. So yeah, this has been the 49 Mercury. Hope you enjoyed this. Hope you enjoyed this drawing. Have a go with yourself in pencil if you like to. But uh, yeah, thanks very much for watching. Any links in my description box, and give it a like and sub if you want. And I'll be back with another video very soon. Thank you.